Media. Quick tips. So let's say you have a clip of video like this that you're quite happy with except for one thing. The sky. It's a bit... Nah. If only we could have had a sky more like this one. Well, with the magic of masking, we can. And here's how. First, open your clip in Sony Vegas Pro. Click on the Event Pan Crop tool, here. Now, enable the Mask tool, here, and ensure that the cursor is at the very beginning of the clip. Click on the Rectangle Mask tool, and drag a large rectangle over the top half of the image. Now, if we take a quick peek at the monitor, we can see that the mask is covering the bottom half of the image, but we need it at the top. So, we need to go here and change the mode from positive to negative, like this. That's better. Now click on the Anchor Creation tool, and add a few more anchor points along the line like this. Using the normal Edit tool, create a border roughly following the skyline, but with a little bit of a buffer zone between them. Like this. To make the angular anchor points look a bit more fluid, right-click on one with your mouse, select Initiate Tangents, then All. Now when you click on them, these little handles will appear that will allow you to turn the angles into curves. There, that looks about right. Now we need to feather the edge to let the sky blend in. So click on Feather Type and select Both. And bump the feather percentage quite high. Here I'm going with 27%. Which, as you can see, has turned the hard border into a nice fuzzy glow. All that's required now is to bring in the clip of the sky of your choice. Here's one I found on a stock video site. And now just slide it in beneath the doctored clip and there it is. All that's required now is to render it to video, and this is what you get. And that's your lot. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe, like and share. This has been Amicia Quicktip, and I've been William Hugh.